Hello everyone. So in this video we're going over the new addition to the game, the Muscle Sprout. So you've just finished unlocking the lab, you got the dome open, and you're done with the whole unlocking the lab part. When you turn around to go back down the ramp, or jump over the edge, however you want to do it, you'll see these pink red uh, balls all the way around the room. There are 30 of them. They are Muscle Sprouts. I know they're not spelled wrong, that is the correct way to spell it, because it is a Brussels sprout wrapped with uh, human muscles. And if you pick up all the little things like this around the lab during your quest to get the pond, uh, the pond lab unlocked and read them, you will see that the doctor, Dr. Wendell, was actually trying to find a way to make large Brussels sprouts encased in muscle. Uh, and thus muscle sprouts. Now there's only 30 of them in the game right now. I have waited almost two weeks in game, about 12, 13 days of in game time to see if they would respawn, and they have not. I don't know if that is just something that they have to fix, or if the respawn time is ridiculously long. Not 100% sure. So, I'm gonna go ahead and go back up to my uh, aircraft carrier, my green base, which is right here on the pond, so that I can do some testing and kind of show you what it can be used for. And also to, to remind you, there's only 30. Don't know how long it's going to take them to respawn, so you have to use them very carefully, very sparingly. I'm going to be a little, uh, almost wasteful in this video, but that's because this is an older save file. I have a much newer save file that still has 29 on it, because I just wanted to test to see exactly what it would do um, with certain applications of the Muscle Sprout. So first I'm going to come in here. I want to get some Workers Comp. I want two of them. So let's take a look at the, well, actually we'll do that when we get to the thing. So I have two workers comp on me. Now there's a plus version to every smoothie and the, and the muscle sprout is used to make that. So what you do is go to your smoothie station, get that out of there. I don't know why that's in there. Oh, they changed this. You're going to put one and then two, two of the same of the regular type of smoothies in here, as well as one muscle sprout. So you want for this, I want to make workers comp plus. I'm going to have two regular workers comp and a muscle sprout in here. I'll hit craft. Now that I've done that, you see it has the little sparkles. It's workers comp plus. If you go down here, that actually shows that I have both of these. So I could do that and it would pull this and this. You see, I can't craft yet, so we got to put another one. And then it'll give me smoothie plus. Because we're going to test, see how much that heals you as well. It would help if I clicked that button all right so now i have workers comp plus and smoothie plus i've already done the test i know exactly how long it takes for uh workers comp plus to wear off as well as workers comp i'm going to go ant armor just to give it a nice even 10. oh let's say where the where is my ant armor i gotta put some stuff away real quick Apparently, I'm carrying everything in the world. Oh, there we go. New controller input. So trying to get used to the button sometimes. All right. Oh, my hand armor. Go ahead and equip that. Now we all know if you're holding, if you're wearing ant armor, the full set, like I am, all three pieces, you can hold up to eight. I apologize for that. My computer decides it wants to make all the most random noises possible. I don't care that you've turned on storage sense. That's what the alert was. So I have eight right there. Now I'm going to go into my menu. I'm going to equip that right there, and I'm going to put that right there, and I'm going to put one of those right there. So while I wait for a second, actually no, what time are we at? So I'm going to wait till I see a certain time on the clock for this recording. And I've got about 10 seconds. I'll activate the uh, workers comp plus, and then we'll sit there and chat for six minutes. Three, two. 
Now, I'm just going to stay in here and hold 10 out of 10. Now, while we do that, I'm going to go back into my menu because I know I've got time. The workers' comp regular is two minutes long. So this being the workers' comp plus, it's going to last longer. Well, let's take a look at the, the muscle sprouts. An edible hybrid Brussels sprout. Chewy muscle flaps, ripe and flex, restores hunger when eaten, but also causes pain. Edible and pinch. Sprouts give it and sprouts take it away. So it will fix your hunger, but it's, it's going to fix your hunger, but take away from your health. Which, you know, sounds lovely. But we'll go over that as well since I have the smoothie question mark. We're going to, I'm going to minimize my health down on, say, three or four muscle sprouts. And then take one regular smoothie, see how much it jumps up, and then put myself back to full health, bring myself back down the same number again, and then do the smoothie question mark. Which we can actually do that now while we stand here and watch 10 out of 10. And we're still going, that's only a minute and eight right now, only a minute and 10. So on number five, which is where I have the muscles route to you, if you watch, it takes a decent chunk. We're going to do three. That was three. So now with the regular smoothie question mark on number eight, it brings it up a decent little chunk. But because I'm full, because I'm hungry, it's gonna I'm gonna heal slowly over. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm full, full and hungry. It'll heal over time. So I can stay in here and wait for that, or I could just spam out the rest of my deal. Now the same thing. We're gonna do three of the uh, muscle sprouts. One, two, and three. Now we're going to go and hit that number four, and it is double the health gen, double the health of a regular smoothie uh, question mark. So that's maybe, what, two of those? It is kind of pricey, though. I mean, it would make sense. You put two of them into it, you get two of them back. Um, the fact that M Muscle Sprouts, there's only 30 of them in game right now, uh, makes it very, very expensive to use them for that right there. But like I said, this is an older save file. I have a newer save file. That when I go back to playing my regular game, when I'm building a new base over there on top of the pagoda, um, I still have 29 uh, muscle sprouts in a box uh, saved up. Still waiting to find out exactly what time when the uh, respawn on them is. Like I said, I'm at 12 or 13 days. They haven't respawned yet. And just kind of curious uh, how long it's actually going to take. And just as a side note, we're going on almost three minutes of still holding 10 out of 10. Uh, we'll be here for probably another three minutes. <laughs> Because I started this at five minutes on the timer in my recording uh, software. So I'm just waiting to see exactly when it drops. Um, I think it's going to drop somewhere around the 11 minute mark. we still got three minutes of me just standing here uh, holding 10 out of 10. Um, I know that's going to be kind of boring. I mean, feel free to speed up if you want. But you can 10 out of 10 with your ant armor on and... Now your workers' comp, instead of lasting two minutes, from my previous test was six. I'm going to confirm it here with an actual, like, looking at the clock right when I hit the, uh, hit the, drank the smoothie to see exactly how long it is. I do believe it is going to be uh, six minutes. But like I said, muscle sprouts, very rare, very limited, brand new to the game. Um, so we're still kind of waiting to see if... They're going to adjust their respawn if they're going to give us another way to get more of them. Uh, because right now, using them for smoothie pluses doesn't really seem like the best idea possible since there's so few of them in-game. So what I'm going to do is go here. Oops, sorry. Craft, decor, uh, resources. And if I scroll down, muscle sprout. As you see, if I made the rest of them, they would all pop up. So that's what it's for is literally for making the plus question marks sorry sorry the plus uh, smoothies plus versions of every smoothie and in order to do that like i said it's two versions of the regular smoothie and one question mark i'm sorry one muscle sprout in there to get the uh, plus version so let's go make some more i've got time i'll hold all 10 of these for a while i still got at least probably another minute of holding these so what we got up here which one's this Oh, liquid gills. We'll make a plus version of that. And we'll test that as well. Waiting to make sure that it's not going to drop them at five minutes. 
doesn't. All right, so still holding 10 out of 10. We're going on five minutes, 15 seconds. And now I have Liquid Gills Plus. So I'm gonna then get a Liquid Gills and a Liquid Gills Plus and hop in the water and just see what it does. I'm gonna put on all my best gear, all my good, um, my, that one mutation Martine and take a look at exactly what it looks like with Liquid Gills on and without it on. And for that particular one, what, the only thing I'm worried about is how much time you have. So when I, I'll start up the Liquid Gills and then check the timer. I'll pause the video, so I'll wait for that to, to finish on my end. So you guys don't have to sit there and wait for two minutes. And then I'll put the next one on. All right, so we are closing in on six minutes, still holding 10 out of 10. It's exactly six minutes. So it is a six minute long smoothie with, um, oh, using the muscle sprout. All right, so now let's go put my ant armor back, get my bubble helmet and stuff back on, and grab one more liquid gill, regular liquid gills while I'm here. So I've got the regular in three and the plus in four. Got all my stuff. With everything status martine is on so i should have around 180 seconds of underwater time just as is and that's what we're going to check so first thing we check is one let's see we'll go up here it says 178 okay i don't know why my kid's sideways but whatever So 178 wearing bubble helmet and with Martine active. So now I'm going to activate just the liquid gills, the regular one, which is a number three. I'm not picky. Now it's good for two minutes, roughly. And that puts us at 222. 223, if you look at it right there at the very second. So 223 for liquid gills plus bubble helmet plus Martine. So now I'm going to pause the video wait for that timer to run out and then we're going to come back and try liquid gills plus all right we're back <clears throat> so as you see we're back to 178 also too part of one of the new patches is you can jump out of the water anywhere literally in the middle of the water you can jump kind of a pain when you're trying to get out of the water at the edges of certain things but that's either ne neither here nor there now we're going to activate the liquid gills plus remember the liquid gills was 223 so let's see if this one is going to make your available oxygen time underwater longer i'm gonna go ahead and activate this i'm gonna jump for the hell of it nope still the same so it is more or less useless to do liquid gills plus since it gives you the same amount of time underwater as liquid gills Thankfully, this is an older save. My newer save, I haven't used any of... I've only used one um, muscle sprout, which is nice. I don't have to worry about, you know, accidentally wasting them like this. So, uh, some smoothies I would recommend not using them for, such as Liquid Gills. Uh, they work quite well for others, such as um, Workers' Comp. If you're wanting to test them out, though, see what works best for you, I would recommend doing a save before actually making the smoothie. Then test out the smoothie, and if you realize that was a waste of time, revert back to your save so that you don't lose the muscle sprout. Just because they are so rare right now, being the fact there's only 30 in the game, until they come back to us and say, hey, we've added them, or we've done this, or we've done that, we're giving you a way to get more. So, if you guys like this content, would like to see more like it, hit that like and subscribe button. Um, I stream on my YouTube and on my Twitch. The link for my Twitch will be in the description below. Uh, stop by a live stream if you like. Say hi. Ask me any kind of questions you got. And I'll do my best to get you the answers. But until the next stream or the next video, you guys have a good one.